The Northern Lights have seen queer sights, but the queerest they ever did see was the night on the marge of Lake LaBarge. I cremated Sam McGee. Now Sam McGee was from Tennessee, where the cotton blooms and blows. Why he left his home in this pole in the south to roam on the pole, nobody knows. He was always cold, but the thought of gold seemed to hold him like a spell. Though he'd often say in his homely way that he'd sooner live in hell. <laughs> on Christmas Day, we made our way over the Dawson Trail. Talk of your cold through the parka's fold, it stabbed like a driven nail. If our eyes would close, our lashes froze till sometimes you couldn't see. Wasn't much fun, but the only one to whimper was Sam McGee. And late that night, as we lay packed tight in our robes beneath the snow, the dogs were fed, and the stars overhead were dancing heel and toe. He turns to me and Cap, says he, I'll cash in this trip, I guess. And if I do, I'm asking that you won't refuse my last request. Well, he seemed so low, I just couldn't say no. And he says with a sort of a moan, it's this cursed cold, and it's got right to hold till I'm chilled clean through to the bone. It ain't being dead, it's my awful dread of the icy grave that pains. So I want you to swear that, foul or fair, you'll cremate my last remains. Now, pal's last need is a thing to heed, so I swore I would not fail. We started on at the break of dawn, but God, he looked ghastly pale. He crouched in the sleigh and raved all day of his home in Tennessee. And before nightfall, the corpse was all that was left of Sam McGee. There wasn't a breath in that land of death, and I hurried, horror-driven, but the corpse had hit that I couldn't get rid because of a promise given. He was lashed to the sleigh, and he seemed to say, you may tax your brawn and your brains, but you promised true, and it's up to you to cremate my last remains. Now, a promise made is a debt unpaid, and the trail has its own stern code. In the days to come, though my lips were numb in my heart, how I cursed that load. Every night in the lone firelight, while the huskies round in the ring howled up their woes to the hidden snows, oh God, how I loathed the thing. Every day that lifeless clay seemed to heavy and heavier grow. Down I went, though the dogs were spent and the grub was getting low. The trail was bad, and I felt half mad, and I Till I came to the marge of Lake LaBarge, and a derelict there lay. It was jammed in the ice, but I saw in a trice it was called the Alice May. I looked at it, thought a bit, looked at my frozen chum, then here, said I, with a sudden cry, is my crematorium. Some planks I tore from the cabin floor, and I lit the boiler fire. Some coal I found that was lying around, and I heaped the fuel higher. The flames just soared, and the furnace roared, such a blaze you seldom see. Then I burrowed a hole in the glowing coal, and I stuffed in Sam McGee. Then I took a hike, for I did not like to hear him sizzle so. The huskies growled, and the heaven to scowl, and the wind began to blow. The air was cold, but hot tears rolled down my cheeks, and I don't know why. And a greasy smoke and an inky cloak came streaking through the sky. I do not know how long in the snow I wrestled with grisly beer. But the stars came out and danced about air again I had been sheared near. I was sick with dread, but I gravely said, I'll just take a peek inside. Is that how it goes? No. Yes, it is. I'll just take a peek inside. I guess he's cooked, and next time I looked, the door I opened wide. And there sat Sam, looking cool and calm, in the heart of the furnace roar. And he wore a smile you could see for a mile. And he said, please close that door. It's fine in here, but I greatly fear you'll let in the cold and the storm. Since I left Plum Tree down in Tennessee, it's the first time I've been warm. <laughs> strange things done in the midnight sun by the men who moil for gold. The Arctic trails have their secret tales that would make your blood run cold. The northern lights have seen queer sights. The queerest they ever did see was the night on the marge of Lake LaBarge. I cremated Sam McGee. Woo! <laughs>